How y'all doing? We have the wide receiver, <coughs> Devin Carter. Questions for Devin? So Devin, sort of the lead question, I've asked everybody. Just give me an assessment on both what the offense did Saturday and how you did Saturday. Um, I feel like the offense did rather well in my view. I would say that, like, it was just a couple plays that we needed to make, and when it when it was crunch time, we didn't make them. So the game ended up going, you know, the way it went instead of the way we wanted it to. And you personally, what did you think? Uh, I feel like I did pretty good myself, but there's definitely more out there. I feel like I had more more left in me. Like what? If you could add a couple of more pieces that you didn't do, what would you like to have done? Uh, I like to establish myself in the blocking game a little bit more and. Uh, probably make some more plays downfield. Is that area you guys got to get better at as a group, wide receiver blocking? Uh, yes, I would say so, but I always think the first game goes a little slow for me. Like, it's kind of – you kind of have to feel it out. Felt like you got open, and did you feel like Garrett was able to locate you? Yeah. You yeah, I did. I did, honestly. Uh, we did good as an offense, like I said. Just little things that we got to clean up. How were the corners? Were they up on you? Were they? Uh, they gave us multiple multiple looks. Yeah. What's it like for you playing with a dual threat or mobile quarterback opposed to maybe some other quarterbacks you dealt with because you haven't always had that in, in terms of you know play could be drawn up for you and he could just decide to, to keep it and you're standing out there. Like yeah, that. I mean it's honestly it's, it's good to have a mobile quarterback. You know he gets in trouble, he can find a way to get positive yards, create first downs. It's kind of like having another running back on the field that can throw the ball. Do you have to do anything? Do you have to do anything like impromptu sometime to like be like, okay, all of a sudden I got to be a blocker here. That I wasn't yeah, yeah, sometimes, sometimes. Devin, a lot of times on the quarterback scrambling out, especially with, on the flip side with Drew Allard, the receivers seem to like cross and come in. Is that something you guys need to kind of get better at when Garrett's scrambling to try and come back towards the ball to give him a better chance to throw down the field? Yeah, probably. How do you guys work on that? Just practice, just reps. It just comes with repetition. Any, they do anything that you didn't expect Saturday, or was it pretty much what you thought they were going to do? I would say it was pretty much what we thought they were going to do, for the most part. Well, what maybe were there any things that caught caught you off guard at all? Uh, not really. From like from my game plan, my my studying, not really. Then when you're on an offense that is in need of a big play, you know, you. you you're moving the ball a little bit, but uh, you, know, you know how hard it is to go all the way down the field without something bad happening. What goes through your mind uh, as, as an individual player? You know, kind of how, how how can you convince yourself that you got to make that big play? Uh, I really just feel like it's that that feeling comes when the ball's in the air. You know, like you get the play call from the sideline, and then it's like okay, it could go to me or multiple other guys. So I mean. When the ball's in the air, we just gotta just gotta make the plays. Where does this offense go from here? Now you've got a game under your belt against the number seven team in the country. In your opinion, what what needs to happen from here on out? Well, they say you make the biggest jumps from first to second week, so I feel like we're gonna make a big jump this week. I think we're not satisfied, but we we feel like we we can get things going. In what ways? What what things? Just the offense as a whole. We can just come together and be solid, you know, for the whole entire game. We didn't, we weren't sloppy a lot, so. Okay. Yeah, but you say you get that feeling when the ball is in the air. Yeah. When you got open this last week, it looked, I mean, it looked like the ball stayed there forever. <laughs> I mean, what's going through your mind as you're waiting for it? Just catch it. Just make sure I catch it. What was it like for you to, to play there, given that, you know, you were almost going to be on that team? Yeah, I mean, it was cool. It was a good experience, honestly. I mean, I got to play in it, in the stadium regardless, but I prefer our stadium over theirs. So that is how excited are you for your first home game here? Yeah, I'm very excited. Are there some things, when you, when you talk about big jump offensively, are, are there some things that can maybe you can uh, take advantage of in the passing game? Uh, uh, what, what, are you, what are you talking about when you talk about making jumps? I'm just talking about cleaning things up and just, yeah. Just clean it up like uh, just. Whatever we had wrong going in that game, then, you know, just clean up the little things. I got you. Devin, you guys would like to have the more explosive plays. How do you, how do you generate those? 
just making the play in, in the game. It's kind of like you just got to do it. Just be a, a positive leader and try to motivate the guys, you know. First game, it doesn't determine the season, so you just got to keep reminding yourself and other players that take day by day, keep stacking, and that's that. You've experienced it kind of both ways and been around a long time, kind of what Cody's been asking others. What are your thoughts on starting off the season big game against a major opponent versus an FCS having that two, or would you rather the FCS be weak? Nah, I, I kind of liked uh, opening it up against a big opponent. You see where you're at, and it's good competition, you know. So you get a good gauge on where you feel like your team is at. How then, this is the other thing about everybody. How then do you, because you're so locked in for Penn State all camp, how do you not, not get lazy, but not lose focus this week knowing it's a, a lower division? Oh, we treat every team the same. That's what you got to do. Watch any of Duquesne yet? What do you think of them? We know that they're uh, they're they're not a bad team, mm -hmm. so we can't we can't take them lightly. We got to put our foot on the gas and just go. Okay. Anything else for Devin? All right. Thank you very much.